Hey y'all, so I apologize in advance if you see any spring rolls popping out. <laughs> this shirt is built weird, but I love it. It's comfy, so just know, you know, modesty is policy around here, but sometimes, you know, we play peekaboo. <laughs> okay, so hey, hi, my name is Marina. <laughs> um, I have a YouTube channel. Oh my gosh, it's gonna be one of them videos, ain't it? Look at this, y'all. Look at this. He never, at, like, initiates affection he he's okay with getting affection but he never initiates it oh my gosh i had to save that and keep that in here because that was precious but today we're doing just to decorate with me and clean with me i got a new rug that i want to show you guys i got it off amazon and then i need to do some touch-up paint coats on some cabinets and put on some hardware finally because i think my cabinets have been without hardware for like three months now Honestly, by now, I've just gotten used to digging my fingernails up under the cabinet to open it. So, it feels weird. I don't even reach for the handle now. I just dig my finger up under the cabinet. But I'm really excited to show you guys this rug. I did not know if I would like it or not, but I love it. It is just the color I wanted, and I will explain to you guys. I know I talk a lot about liking bright white, and this rug is not bright white. It is cream colored, and that's not usually my favorite colors. But... For a rug, it's exactly what I need because I have kids, I have dogs, I have Shane. So I needed something that would hide the dirt, y'all. Let's just be honest. I needed something that would hide the dirt. <laughs> but before I show you the rug, can we just can we just talk about this? Like, can we can we just acknowledge the elephant in the room? Look at this couch, y'all. What I have never in my 29 years owned a brand new couch. I paid for this thing in cash. Never have I ever owned a brand new couch. I'm so proud of it like i am mulan's daddy proud like i sh she walks up right and she wins the war takes care of the emperor like i couldn't be any prouder if i was mulan's daddy that's how proud i am of it now keep in mind it doesn't take a lot to make me happy and this is no like expensive arm and a leg give your firstborn costly kind of couch i got this at the big lots for 7.99 after 20 percent off coupon <laughs> but $7.99 is a lot of money for me. And I got, listen, this is the first time I ever bought a protection plan. It was $100. I'm like feeling like I'm actually an adult now. <laughs> it really felt like I walked into Big Lots of Toddler and I walked out an adult. <laughs> I could have probably found a safer knife to use. It looks like I'm just sawing. <laughs> I'm just sawing my rug. Don't mind me. I'm just sawing my rug. <laughs> Somebody come get her. She's dancing like a stripper. Oh, somebody come get her. <laughs> How many more YouTubers you know can tango with a saw knife in a rug in their living room in their in their llama pajamas? <laughs> This is my leg after I've wore socks all day. <laughs> that indentation, that's exactly what my ankles look like. Oh, I spy a spring roll. Okay, this is the Eliza's, 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 Eli let's call it the Eliza rug. I'll have it linked down below. Um, I don't normally go for this style, but I saw this on Amazon and I was like, oh man. I looked at the reviews and a lot of people were mad that the white wasn't actually white. It was more of a cream colored and they said it didn't go well with gray wood floors. Well, I do not agree with that at all. I think it looks amazing against my gray wood floors. And I love the fact it's not bright white. Let's get down to business. To defeat the They sent me daughters when I asked for sons. Y'all remember when I used to call the turds the Huns way back in the day, like two months ago? <laughs> okay, so y'all, I'm so excited. This is what it looks like against my couch. 
I am in love. Go if let me encourage you right now to go out of your comfort zone. If you like something but it's not necessarily in your style or what you normally decorate in, still go for it. If you think in your mind, I don't know if this will work or not, get it. Because you know what? Even if this rug didn't look as good as it does against this couch, I would have still beat myself in the butt for, oh, I'm sorry, B-U-T-T, for um, not getting it. So, and plus, okay, I don't know why I switched to this clip, but the couch is soft. And the pillow is soft too. <laughs> Everything's soft. <laughs> I'm going to get more throw pillows. I just have to pick the right ones this is a sign but wow these are going fast these are i'm just showing you guys some decor that i'll be using in this upcoming week i got this at the dollar general y'all and it has some depth to it it's like got boards that look like doors right there do you see and it's actually a painting ten dollars at the dollar general y'all are sleeping on the dollar general the dollar general has so much cool decor i about flipped out in the decor aisle i also got this at the dollar general i've been trying to add more of this teal turquoise color into my kitchen just to give it some color you know so it's not all gray white gray white gray white i love it it was only five dollars i got the greenery that's in it at the dollar general too for three bucks not bad at all so then what i did after i put my rug down and everything i went and i painted all my cabinets i didn't show you guys that because my phone was on charge it was dying but i painted them because i really wanted to get my hardware on them to show you guys I decided against keeping the silver bar hardware that I had and go with these, which are the ones that I used off my pantry, which are the ones that Shane picked out. Since he liked those, I was like, you know what? They grew on me. They're different. They're out of my comfort zone, but I really like the contrast that they added to my kitchen cabinets. I'm really thinking about getting some of those light strips, the LED strips to go underneath my cabinets versus these um, wired under cabinet lights. I just think it'll do a lot better. Plus the wires are driving me crazy. I hate that you can see them, but I don't want to drill them through the cabinet. So really either battery powered or the LED strips are my only two options that I, I'm aware of. Now the paint is still wet because I put the hardware on prematurely because I mean I have zero patience, but it looks so much better. Y'all, look what I just got in the mail. Can you guess? Can you guess? Can you guess? Can you guess? I'm so excited. I'll show you guys that more up close and in depth whenever I show you guys my spice rack that I'm doing, my DIY spice rack. Um I'm also going to work on I'm gonna keep that a secret because that's kind of a big deal. I don't know. It's so hard for me to keep secrets from you guys because you guys are my best friends. <laughs> so it's hard for me to be like, I'm gonna keep a secret from you because usually you tell your best friend your secrets, but I really want it to be a surprise because I'm super stoked about it. But I will tell you this. This wall I want to transform this weekend. I also, and every wall I do, like I did with my pantry, if you didn't notice, I painted the trim. So that's how I'm doing the trim so I don't have to go out throughout my whole house and paint the trim. I'm painting the trim of the area I'm working on. So when I do this wall, I'll paint that trim. And then I also have some plans for this wall right here that I want. And then I'll paint that trim. This wall is going to be transformed completely. Well, like this area is going to be transformed completely. So this coming up week 
it'll be Monday through Friday. This week that we're on right now, it is Mon Monday through Saturday. So you guys will be getting a video tomorrow and it is a kitchen deep clean with me. I'm going in and really elbow grease scrubbing a lot of the areas that I have not scrubbed in forever. All the paint splashes that are all over my floor that have been all over my floor for years now. <laughs> um, I'm getting them up and, and just really cleaning, dusting, disinfecting because my kitchen is in need of it like I struggle to keep it clean on the daily you guys can imagine how dirty it is like deep clean wise so that's going to be tomorrow's video and then next week I'm going to have I'm not sure of all of them yet but as of right now I do know for a fact I'm going to have a DIY spice rack video up I'm going to have a bathroom makeover up for the kiddos for the smaller bathroom and then um, my weekly grocery haul and two other videos that I'm not sure what. You guys let me know. What kind of videos do you want to see from me? I'm down for whatever. I do have a lot of Amazon hauls coming at you guys. Because after trying on those clothes yesterday, I absolutely love them. I went and I ordered more. Um, so, I'll that'll be soon. Let me know what you guys want to see. I've been doing these five days a week video. And so far, so good. It's not too hard on me. So, I'm loving it. I'll keep doing it. Um, cause it's something that you guys have told me you guys want me to do and I'm down for it. Cause I like seeing, I like talking with y'all every single day. So anyways, I hope you guys have a blessed morning, evening, night, whatever it is, wherever you're at. And I will see y'all later.